and my heart was beating. I was like, oh shit, like, I almost got my life taken away from me that second when YouTube welcome back to my channel and I know I've been posting for like two weeks because I've been busy lately so and I haven't got like any ideas to what I would do on my YouTube channel so so today I'm gonna be doing something a little different I don't think I ever do in the store yes I have yeah I have the one story time so today I'm gonna be doing a story time on how I lost my V card I don't know why I'm doing this, but how I lost my V card, okay? So, I know a couple of you guys that's on this video right now, clicking on my video, y'all want to hear me spill the tea on how I lose my V card, okay? When I was a kid, well, I'm still a kid, but when I was little, I would always watch a video. It'd be like so interesting to watch a video, but before we get to the video, Please make sure to hit the subscribe button down below, turn on the post notification. We almost got 3k subscribers and guys, I want to public my subscribers so bad but it's not working, it's like I don't know how to do it and the sun's getting a little hot, you feel me? So grab your hot Cheetos, grab your freaking drinks or whatever and stay tuned if you want to hear how to lose my V-card. Since I love you guys so much and I know some of you guys that's watching the video. It's probably from my school, being nosy or whatever. Hi, how you doing? Okay, so this is how the whole story started. I don't even know how to start a story, but like, I'm pretty nervous. Okay, so let's get right into the video. It was like my freshman year. My freshman year, yes. And I was chilling, right? So it was like, the beginning of freshman year, I was bored or whatever. Um, I have this guy who I've been talking to, right, for like a month, I guess. Fuck, this like, hold on, y'all, hold on, but my neighborhood just pulled over, bro. This is fucking embarrassing. They're gonna see me look at the fucking camera like I'm fucking stupid. Shit. I'm hungry. <coughs> I'm hungry as hell, so I'm eating noodles. If you Asian and you never done this before, eating raw noodles, let me tell you. I don't know what the fuck you're doing, you probably not even Asian, okay? Because every Asian knows this freaking thing where you just eat noodles without putting water in them. Okay, let me get back to the story. Um, it was my freshman year, like, first semester of freshman year. I've been talking to this dude for like, I'm guessing like a month or whatever, and me and him. We was like talking, okay? It's like talking to where the point like y'all say each other like I love you, whatever, this and that. You know, basically dating, but not don't have a title. So it's like me and him, we like this type of relationship where like we're not together but we're saying each other like I love you and stuff and we don't be talking or flirting with other females or other guys the same way we're doing with each other, okay? So that's what me and him was doing. And I apologize if I'm smacking, but okay. Okay. So one day we decided to link. It was like on Saturday, and so I can't bring no guys over, mind you that. And we was gone, whatever. And me being prepared, I'm always prepared. I got shaved my leg, my you know whatever. Like I shaved. Everything y'all think I'm shaving, okay? So I grab my bag, like a bag, like a bag, like a holder bag. So I put everything in there, like everything that girls need. So I got my bag, whatever. I got everything in there, okay? And I got everything in there, and then like, since I get bringing the guys over, I go to his house, and he was, he was the first ever dude I ever go to a guy's house. I was scared though, cause you know, like, no offense, but like, black people parent, they be scary. I be scared. Oh my god, like, I be scared. Like my heart was beating. Okay, I was like, bro, what if what's just stole damn? Like I was like, what if she stole damn rock at me, bro? If she sees me, I said, who the fuck is that person? 
Like, I was scared, so like, I feel your problem with me, like, oh, she being racist, black, like, like, okay. I told you, no offense, okay? But y'all know they be crazy, okay? So like, Asian parents be crazy too, but shit. Because I go over to his house and like, he don't drive, so like, one of his homies and him, they drove to my place and then picked me up. So I literally sneak out because my parents are strict. Okay. So, I snuck out. It was like daytime. I snuck out and I go over to his house. We was watching movie, whatever, and so he had to get some food, whatever. Like he wanted to get some food, chip or whatever, because they forgot to get it. Cause we was like chilling, watching movie, and I got my friend with me too. So like, my friend was like there. They picked my friend up first, and then they picked me up. And so my friend was there with me. So it wasn't just me with two dudes. It was me, my friend, his homeboy, and then him. So my friend was with me, he was, this other dude was with me, his friend was with me, and then he decided to go, walk to go, get some food, snack, and then he came back. And then, um, I'm guessing my friend and his homeboy decided to leave us two alone. And so, they went to a different room, and we went to a different room. Like, they was in the living room, and me and old dude, that I was talking to, we was in his homies room, okay? Like, what the fuck? I feel like guys just already had everything planned before, like, doing guys girls over. Okay. So, me and old dude, we was chilling in the bed. Old dude got, um, his homie got, like, TV in the room, too. So, like, we was watching movies, Netflix, and chilling or whatever. And... So, after we was chilling, let me get to the whole point, okay? Because I'm just going back and forth with all this stuff. So, my friend and his homeboy were chilling in the living room. They were just talking. They're just friends. So, like, me and old dude, we was talking. So, I'm guessing old dude and his homie, they talk about girls. I don't know. I feel like guys and girls, guys just talk about the girls they be trying to fuck with or whatever. I feel like they do the same thing as what girls do. So, we was in a room. Me and the dude I was talking to was in a room. We was chilling, whatever. And then I got a call from my mom, right? She was like... Where are you? And I was like, oh shit, like I gotta go home ASAP, bro. Like, and so me and my friend, we hurry up and get all stuff, right? And so we went to, um, we went in the car and the homies and the dude I was talking to, they drove us to my place and I was telling my mom how like, I got like, I was just basically lying to her. I said like, oh, my friend, that's my friend's brother. And she took, he decided to take me to the store because I needed to buy something like makeup and stuff. <laughs> and so I was at the home or whatever, at my house or whatever. And I checked in my bag, right? I was like, oh shit, son's missing. Cause like when I went over to his place, you know, I was getting my lip gloss or whatever, trying to get pretty or whatever. Cause we were just chilling. You know when girls be shy or whatever, they just, Get the lip gloss and just put it on the lips, trying to like, I'm gonna just do some stupid shit, like pretend to be on the phone when there's nothing on the phone. So I got like a lipstick to avoid the awkwardness. What the fuck is it? Okay, hold on. To avoid the awkwardness, and that's when like I realized, shoot, I'm missing something. Like I was like, ayo, I call old dude. I was talking to Doctor Ayo. Um, did I left anything in your homie's bed, like, or anything? Like, can you look for something? Because I feel like I'm missing something. And my friend was like, oh, shoot, you missing your mom's visa card. I was like, oh, shit. And I was like, hey, yo, hey, yo, like, can you go look for my, I, I was talking to the I was talking to. I said, hey, yo, can you please go look for my visa card, bro? Like, I'm going to get my ass killed, bro, because, like, I lost her visa card, bro. I don't know how the thing got in there. I guess, I'm guessing I was trying to order something online or whatever, and I used her card. So I put it down, I, it back. I forgot to give it back to my mom. I said, like, oh shit, let me call him real quick. And I called him, I was like, hey yo, can you look around your homie's room to see if I lose my cards, my visa card there? And thankfully, he's not a type to steal. So he was like, oh shit, yeah, it's right here. And so the my dude I was talking to and his friend decided to drove back again and give me the visa card, a card. Whew, never again. 
So that's the story time how I lose my Visa card. What you thought the story was gonna be? The fuck your nasty ass, <laughs> bruh. <laughs> you thought the story was gonna be something else? Hell nah, what the fuck. This is our positivity, okay? And I know I'm cussing a lot of my videos. I even got warned from YouTube that I need to stop posting that positive thing, cussing and stuff, whatever. But y'all some nasty motherfuckers, okay? So let me tell this, if y'all came here to hear me lose my virginity type of story time, no, it's not like that, shit. Like, I lose, like, I, if y'all haven't heard a story time me getting my first kiss over, like, the summer before freshman year, yeah, I got my first kiss summer before freshman year. So what you thought this was? Okay, so, that's how I lost my Visa card, and y'all over here trying to hear a tea or whatever, and I know y'all eat some people watching my videos. I don't be doing that stuff. I'm a good kid. Put an angel right here. Give them a little freaking, what you call that? I don't know what you call that, but that. That's the story time. I hope you like my story time. Make sure to like, comment, subscribe. Definitely subscribe. And follow me on my TikTok. I'm gonna put it at right here, right there, I don't know. And yeah. Tell me that you follow my TikTok, I'm gonna follow you back on my TikTok and rest in peace to Juice World. I recorded the day that he died. I'm probably not gonna upload this until I edit my videos. Cause it be taking me a long time to edit my videos. A lot of you ladies don't have time to edit my videos, but rest in peace to him. I can't even believe just like a lot of people dying. And imagine somebody that you love just died. I feel bad for his family. Like, I wish his family was doing okay because that's just shocking. Um, I, I forgot what I was, I was about to say, but oh yeah, guys, if you little girls are watching my videos right now, I be watching this. I was like you guys too. I watch like lose my virginity video, this and that video, cause I be curious. And let me tell you this: don't lose your virginity. Don't use lose it at a young age. If you are a cry baby, don't lose it because you're going to feel regret. You can feel dirty. You're just going to feel some type of way losing to somebody that is not even somebody you're going to marry, okay? So just don't lose your virginity at a young age because you probably going to regret that. But if you want to enjoy your freedom, fuck! <laughs> but if you want to do some little expense, whatever, that's on you, you feel me? But like, let me tell you. Just at least have protection because getting a pregnancy scare is not a good, it's not a good thing. It's like, it's not a good feeling because I'm trying to stay. So don't lose virginity at a young age unless you're ready, unless you're ready for the consequences, like unless you're ready, prepared for everything, okay? Because you're probably going to do to somebody that you're not even in love with. Or you probably was at the moment, but that person probably don't feel the same way with you. So yeah, but let me tell you this. Let me give you a little advice. If you're talking to somebody and they ask you, are you a virgin? Be like, don't worry about it. Because if you tell them you're a virgin, they can try to take advantage of that shit, okay? Let me tell your dad right now, because I know. Just know that I know. So don't be telling them, because they're going to try to take advantage. Because you know guys like doing stuff with girls that's a virgin. So this is my advice to you guys, because I love you guys. Don't tell them. Just be like, mind your business, this and that. Why does it have to do with this and that, okay? I mean, if you don't care or if you want to do those stuff, that's on you. Enjoy. See, life is not long, whatever. You know, life is short. So enjoy your time. Make sure you just be careful. Don't get pregnant. You don't want to be in high school, middle school, elementary school and get pregnant. You feel me? And I know nowadays elementary school is probably doing some crazy shit too. When I was in elementary school, I even know nothing, okay? Even middle school. So yeah, thank you so much for watching my videos. Please make sure to subscribe. Follow my Instagram, Snapchat, I don't really care about Snapchat, but follow me on my Instagram and TikTok. I can't believe I hit 10K in a week. When I made my videos, right, I hit 10K in just a matter of a week. I'm like at around 16K right now in just like two weeks. I'm like, dang, I grew so fast, yo. If you want to know the story time of how I get viral on my TikTok, then comment down below and make sure to just... Give me little videos of advice, not advice, but like comment down videos, ideas for me to do next because I don't really have anything. And yeah, I love you guys. Bye. See you in my next video.